Factory Antique Mall, now the largest antique mall in America, with 130,000 square feet of antiques and collectibles and 250 dealers. A true shopping destination located off exit 227 on I-81 in Verona. FactoryAntiqueMall.com Everance Financial is grateful to serve this community. As a faith-rooted financial services organization, we're dedicated to helping members grow more confident futures with their values in mind. Community that's doing better together. Karate is a form of unarmed self-defense that originated in Japan more than 4,000 years ago and still practiced today all over the globe. The discipline of karate teaches methods of combat and self-defense while offering emotional and spiritual guidance to its students. American karate borrows elements from various styles of Japanese martial arts to achieve what many believe to be the perfect mix of combat training and self-discipline. We stopped by Brian May's studio to learn more about American freestyle karate. <laughs> I'm currently a second degree black belt right now. That's about, I'd say from first degree, that's about three years of work or so. And I've been a second degree for maybe a year or so. So that's about four years plus all that, all the time before that. With practice, the biggest thing is to just enjoy it. There's no, there's no getting better if you don't enjoy what you're doing. So with anything really, especially karate, I think, Design, commit, succeed. Right? So we're doing board breaking tonight. Is everybody agree? Yes, sir. What's the real underlying meaning of board breaking? Right? Facing your fears. Facing your fears, overcoming. Right? When somebody puts a barrier in front of you. Well, I got started in martial arts about almost approximately about 30 years ago. Just randomly happened. Um, somebody in my grade school class actually invited me down for a buddy week to come try karate. It's just a passion I fell in love with. It was somewhere where I felt comfortable after school. I could go, I felt like I fit in and belong in a great positive um, environment. And one of the things I'm always looking for for teaching, not only the kids and the adults, we're trying to really work on everyone physically, intellectually, emotionally, and socially. Trying to make them really, truly the best version of themselves. Trying to build them up to the best they can be. Well, once I actually started, I was always in fascinated. I mean, I always looked at it thinking that would be something great to do. And once I got into the, the class, just the constant positive reinforcement, someone building you up instead of the daily knocking you down was just wonderful. So that, of course, really um, made me want to push that next level. Say super kid. One of the things, everything that we do within our program is really working on that confidence, discipline, and respect. So a lot of times you're seeing us throw, um, of course, someone grabbing you. The main reason we're working on those grabs is to build their confidence, right? Because we see a lot of kids walk around, they won't make eye contact, they are unable to say hello first. So we really work on being friendly on purpose, um, building that confidence, the discipline, and the respect that really every parent is looking for. Hopefully forever on. I want to stay with this for the rest of my life is the hope. Uh, being an instructor, maybe my own studio one day. Uh, yeah. I would say give karate a try. Couldn't hurt. I only stand to benefit. Um, and whatever you do, stay, stick with it and be the best at it that you can be.
Brian Mays Karate offers classes year-round and is a great activity for the entire family. Hey Virginia is a production of viewer-supported WVPT Public Media. WVPT relies on contributions from viewers like you. So, if you appreciate this show and want to help us keep bringing it to you each month, please consider making a donation to support WVPT.